Catch 32 in three, two, one, go! As this match gets started, all six robots already crossing to midfield, picking up those game pieces they left on the carpet for their robots. It looks like round three coming up for Saber and Super Duper while Sparky goes up on the Blue Alliance charge station. Over on red, 1023 also picks up that docked and engaged charge station coming out of autonomous one point advantage in favor of the Red Alliance as Teleop gets underway. First game pieces being scored over on the red side of the field are coming from Bedford and Digital Dislocators, both of them working on their first attempts at chaining together a few of these game pieces. 1023 already back in their loading zone. All three Blue Alliance robots collaborating with the human players behind the glass in those substations picking up game pieces and racing them back to their community. We're gonna see a link light up. It looks like coming up soon for the Blue Alliance over on Red. Their first one's coming from beha on behalf of Fabricators in Red. Their first link now indicated on the board. A minute and a half remaining in the match. Blue Alliance leads 78 to 64. That lead getting stretched with their first link and now their second link for the Blue Alliance. That link coming from Super Duper in Blue Bumpers. Big collision between red and blue. Red, though, does back off. Playing that defense is digital dislocators. They do have a cone in their robot. Not sure if this defense is opportunistic or if they're going to be sticking around in center field for quite a while here. They do block off Super Duper. Per Super Duper trying to get back to their loading zone. They reach up for a cone. Sticking tight on that defense is still digital dislocators for the Red Alliance. That's allowing some room for Bedford Express and Fabricators to be playing offense for Red. Both alliances match in terms of links. Blue just barely now pulling ahead. Cooperation bonus is in effect. Only one more link needed for this blue alliance to earn that ranking point. It does look like we now are very close to having that fifth link in play for the blue alliance with 30 seconds remaining. That fifth link now indicated on the board. Sustainability bonus activated for the Blue Alliance. They will pick up a ranking point at the conclusion of the match. Red can still pull it off. Not a lot of game pieces missing on that grid to finish off those last two links with 10 seconds remaining now. All of those red robots will go up on the charge station. That activation bonus will be within easy reach for red, especially if they stick tight on that balanced, docked, and engaged Red Alliance charge station. Match 32, final score indicating a Blue Alliance victory. 149 to 133, Blue Alliance takes home the win and also picks up one of those bonus ranking points. That was for their five links in their grid. Red Alliance does not walk a home empty-handed. They did get their bonus ranking point. That, though, was for the charge station. They scored 42 points on that charge station, needing only the 26 for the activation bonus.